Hi, everybody. I love you guys. Thanks so much for letting me take some time off. I'm back for a cute, short, quick glue book session. I pulled out um, my purple folder full of magazine uh, images and colors. And I'm just going to mess around with this today. And... And yeah, um, in my glue book, I'll show you a few things that I've done already. So here's an orange page I did, some other things, doodling. This book is just a glue book that has all kinds of different things in it. So I'm just playing. I am just playing. And I know I've got glare today. I don't have natural lighting, so there's going to be glare. Sorry. Um, and with magazine pages, you know, that's always a thing. Okay, I'm going to get started on this. Um, just to, I'll let you know, too, what's going on with me. Um, I have had a diagnosis of chronic fatigue syndrome and with some digestive issues. So we are working hard but not killing myself in order to get better. So that's, that's my... That's what's going on. And if anybody, if you know anything about chronic fatigue, it is a bugger to get rid of. And uh, so I have been doing my best to take time for myself. And I had to quit filming because I had no, there wasn't any creative juices flowing at all. And I was so lost, just lost. But recently, I've been able to um, get a, I found an, uh, I found a, see, I still have some brain fog, having a hard time with my words. I found a functional medicine doctor not too far away, and then we were able, <clears throat> were able to Zoom, and uh, so it, that helps a lot, because I don't have to travel, because, um, she is, she's an hour away, so I don't have to travel. We can Zoom, but I had to take a bunch of blood tests and such. So I am taking it one day at a time. And then recently, too, we've had some developments in our household. Yeah, a little bit of a family crisis. So that's been kind of my motivation to keep working on getting better. That is part of it because my granddaughter's involved and I want to make sure she's she's in a happy, healthy, peaceful environment. And I want to be able to play with her because she's fun. <laughs> so um, that's my motivation for getting better. I mean, just to be better. I mean, I'm only, I'm 57 and I don't want to be this sit around person all the time. You know, you don't want to be that either. So Anyway, the how I got there, I don't even know. Um, well, that's not true. I kind of do know. I have had some tough, tough goings. Tough goings with my stress levels for years and years and years. And it just finally caught up with me. My adrenals are shot. It's pretty much what's going on. Oops. My sweater's grabbing my little pieces over here. So, in the last little while, I have been... Ooh, tearing noise. I have just been trying to listen to my body and just not overwhelm myself. I have. That's part of the reason why I had to say no to filming and... And crafting. I honestly I'd had no, no creative juices. And it's been, you know, now I stopped this last March, I think it was. So, but I'm just now getting to the point where, hey, I feel that juice, those juices coming back. I've been doodling. I've been um, black line drawing. Been watching videos again about creative people, and it's like, oh, okay, I think I'm getting closer. I'm getting closer. I've had a few really good days in the, you know, 
over 50% capacity kind of days. And uh, yeah, that's that's been encouraging. And I need encouragement with my body. I just don't, I don't want to live like this. I don't want to be that grandma who sits, you know. I want to be the grandma that goes and does stuff with her granddaughter. So there's progress being made. Well, we can say that for certain. Part of the process has been a complete diet chain change. Um, and I found out I am not okay. My body does not like digesting poultry and eggs. And I've been eating eggs almost every day. So that's out of the picture. But I found out I found alternatives for eggs, um, like in baking and such. So, and I miss bread. Bread's something that I miss a lot. But I found an alternative and it's been a good, it's been a good, um, had some good experiments with it so I'm, I'm kind of that can be a game changer yeah so if you want to know more about that let me know I'm gonna put that in the middle I think so let's hold on to that or oh, this in the middle let's do that in the middle that's pretty 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 so well I hope everybody else is doing really well I've been peeking in on you guys you know you video youtubers and seeing how you're all doing got some really wonderful well wishes from my followers and I'm just so pleased I'm just that humbles me actually and I even found some have found new some new people so welcome welcome I've been gone a while and you're finding me now after all of this yeah that makes me happy okay I'm getting there what I like to do with these is start with a darker background and then move towards the center with something lighter so I can have some sort of a focal point. Um, as I can look. Oops. Let's go here with that. And then I put some sort of words that I find within the within the packet. And it's just it's a great way to just Come back if you've been gone for a while, <laughs> such as myself. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's do that. Okay, now let me let me do a little bit of trim on this. Should I rip it? Because it's already got a torn edge. Yeah, the glare is definitely something. We had to change some lighting in this in my craft room, so honestly, I haven't been in here to craft, and it's just made me sad not to be able to, and I was ready to throw everything away at one point, and I'm so glad I didn't. <laughs> I'm glad I, did. I still might I still might do some purging just because I I'm not interested in some of the crafts that I have anymore, and so we'll see. Not making any decisions while I'm in this state. So, how's that? Isn't that pretty? Oh, let's do some lighter colors. Just a little more to pull out. Almost, almost frame this. Can I almost frame this with that? I could do that. Let me frame it. Grabbed a new one, didn't I? Let's grab the old one. Here we go. Oh, oh yeah, though. I did a couple nights. I just went nuts in my glue book here, and I was like, this feels so familiar and so calming. I'm so glad that this is coming back to me. Even, I'm going to do it upside down so the words don't show so much. But it's giving me hope. Giving me hope. And then I will tear these sides off. Just a little. The clear ruler is... Does this one work? I just want to have the same amount on each side, so I need to be able to see. Yeah, that works. And then I just throw it off to the side. So 
So I have really been thinking about you guys and wondering, am I ever going to get back to my peeps? We used to have such good times. So I can't guarantee how often I will be on here. That is not a given at all. I was doing Mondays and Thursdays twice a week for two years. That's close enough. Is that the right side up? Lavender. Isn't that pretty? I love the color purple. It's one of my favorites. I don't mean the movie. Kind of like that. Okay, let's glue her down. Make sure she's an even-ish. I covered up some of my purple bubbles. Oh, that's nice. Okay. The only thing stronger is you. Here we go. Found some words. One thing I have learned from all of this journey is I can do hard things and it's not over yet. But I am committed to the journey. Okay, let's do... I know you can't see this, this is too small. <laughs> So maybe I should put that on some light colored purple as well so that it can be seen. And then I'll trim it out. See how fast these can come together? I mean, I had all of the papers already cut out and ready to go and put in my little files. And uh, I just pick and choose. I'm not even thinking too much. And it's almost like a rainbow. You know, you got your rainbow glue books. And that's kind of what this is. Um, but I'm not, I'm not limiting myself to that and only and just, this is really a good way to just get back into it because I've been away for such a long time. I've done a little bit of doodling, but that's about it. And I'm not doing a good job focusing and filming right now either, so sorry for that. I just wanted to get something out here for you, for everybody, just to let you know I am I'm on the, on the mend, but I'm not here to stay for now. <laughs> Whoops, let's put those in the right order, shall we? There we go. Where's my and I guess I'll glue right here, no big deal. If, you, if, ever, if you've ever smelled fresh lavender, it is strong. Not that my smell is stronger, but I am getting stronger, so. Yeah, I'm hoping to get back to the gym. Uh, hoping to do this on a more consistent basis. And I've got lots of purple left in here to play with on another occasion. Fold that up. There we go. Let's get a little better focus here if I can. I'll bring it up a little. There we go, friends. Just a quick little glue book session using purple in my whatever glue book. 
All right, friends. Love you guys. Thanks again for coming on over and checking out what I'm doing on my channel. I really appreciate you and, and all your friendly thoughts and your caring words. Really do appreciate it. And I thank you so much. Okay, that's it for today. We'll see you again soon, hopefully. Bye-bye.